most anticipated moment of the evening has arrived. It is time for the judges' comments on the performances and the distribution of the much awaited awards. To share their comments, we cordially invite the judges on stage. So I'll try to keep it to within half an hour, or actually 20 minutes, so that we can end with good morning. Um, but first of all, thank you so much for um, the invitation to all of us. Uh, we had an enjoyable evening, um, and uh, perhaps you were wondering what we were doing with the time that we spent. Uh, there was so much to discuss because there were some wonderful uh, performances, so well done to all of you. Um, just a few notes from us, um, and I'm going to use the table so that I make sure that I see what I'm saying. Um, so we won't go through play by play, uh, but just a few things. Um, I think some of the, um, first and foremost working in this space, I think kudos to all four houses. Um, yes, you can give yourselves a round of applause. Uh, because it's not easy uh, working with an outdoor space. It's, it's tough and I heard that you were here till 4.30 in the morning today. Um, so, um, I hope you learned uh, a lot in the process. Um, it's not an easy thing to do. Um, and of course, um, a round of applause to your teachers for supporting you. Um, so just in terms of the, the, the criteria that we were looking at and what the competition is all about, um, I think in general, uh, because we spoke of stage space, there's a lot that you can also do with uh, a stage like this where you've got different levels. Um, so we saw that in certain uh, shows, but not all of them. Um, also with the... Um, with the understanding of character, I think the uh, with with Brecht and with um, Chekhov, one one thing to keep in mind is it's a very different, two different styles between the two also, uh, but at the same time it's very different from perhaps what you may have been used to in if you if you're more familiar with Shakespeare. Um, so sometimes awareness of when the play was written, um, an, an, an understanding of context. Um, knowing what was going on in the world at the time um, helps with an overall production. Um, so notes to your directors and teachers. Um, it's, a, it's a fantastic thing to see schools doing, uh, uh, Resh and Shekhov, but just something to keep in mind. Um, there were some really good performances uh, and also some really good um, ensemble performances where everyone worked together as a team, so well done on that. Uh, but just a few things, um, being convincing, um, if you're holding a book and you're supposed to be old, then hold a book like you're meant to be old, not just hold a book. Um, if you're meant to walk like you're old, then walk like you're old. If you're walking like you're young, then walk like you're young. So a few perhaps things to think about uh, when it comes to characterization. Um, sometimes we saw that this wasn't always apparent. It was, with some characters it was very convincing, with others it wasn't as convincing as it could have been, but there's always potential to develop. Um, okay, just making sure that covered. Yes, um, also with words, um, it's great that all of you went through and got through all of that text, so kudos on that, but um, understanding the words and that's why your character lies in the subtext of the, what the character is saying about themselves what other characters are saying about that character there's a lot that you can um, that you can read through um, so just something to keep in mind um, in terms of choice I think you know you would know best as to your casts and how much of um, how much of how many students you had and uh, who showed up for rehearsals and who didn't. Um, but I think where there is opportunity for an ensemble of a smaller size, um, just choose to 
choose to make your choice, your, your, your choice of extract could always be less tedious because otherwise it's a few characters carrying a heavy script um, and that can be difficult to do. Um, we saw some interesting uh, supporting characters, some wonderful potential uh, with, the, uh, with, the, with the younger perhaps students um, and some interesting use of lighting. Um, but again, all of these things are things that you will learn. I hope that for none of you, this is the last chance that you will get to perform. Um, yeah, um, did I miss anything? No. Okay, all right. Uh, so with that, I'm sure all of you, yes, made it before half an hour. Uh, let's give it back to your compere and thank you very much once again. One more quick thing before uh, I hand over the mic. Uh, so we said thank you to uh, the teachers, but uh, can I ask you students to also give a warm round of applause to your parents? So you're all here because of your parents and caregivers, and they're here with you right now. So thank you so much, parents, for supporting them. Uh, it's, it's amazing to see that we've got such talent in the country. Thank you for all the sacrifices that, you're, that you've done to make it happen. Um, salute you. Back to you, Kampia. I can't see you though.